Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Raw Wellness. Today we are going to do raw recipes and we are going to uh, create a green smoothie. I have my boyfriend John here with me. He is my special helper. This is something we enjoy every day. And we're so excited to bring this to you. Yay! The night before you make the smoothie, it is important to make frozen bananas. What I'm doing here is I'm removing the skin off the bananas and then placing them in a Ziploc freezer bag. This is a great way to help you conserve some fruit and it's a great and convenient way just to have fruit on hand. Once you complete the bananas, I like to put about six or seven bananas at a time to have them and then you can just place them in the freezer and you'll have those at all times. For this recipe, you will need the following. Spinach. Perfect. Preferably um, pre-washed spinach like in a clamshell style. It's very easy, it's very convenient. Mm -hmm. uh, we have an apple here. You can select or mix and match any fruit uh, that you like. Usually we just go with whatever's seasonal. Right now, apples. And then, of course, this is the magic ingredient here. This is the frozen bananas. Uh, these are very important because it gives it a very creamy texture and also masks the flavor of the spinach, which is very bitter. So it makes it really yummy. Oh, Smooch, you don't even really like uh, spinach, do you? No, I'm not a big fan. I used to throw this thing at the, at the ceiling. Yeah. And see if it's still stuck. <laughs> but I, rem I remember growing up, them encouraging me that I'd be strong like Popeye if I had my spinach. Yeah, that's right. Um, and But never did I grow a liking to it. And I, I do recall like when you started, you know, having smoothies like six years ago and mm -hmm. you would always incorporate, you know, your spinach with all, all the fruit. And I just didn't think it looked really appetizing. Um, you used to say it looked like grass. Yes. Or it tasted like grass. <laughs> yes, that's what yeah. your, your uh, I think you use like, like, like long stuff clippings. from the lawnmower. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, and I remember you making me one and uh -huh. I also took it to work and you know, my coworkers thought the same thing. That looked really nasty. Yeah. And um, I, I do remember tasting it, and I said, "Wow, this does taste really good." Yeah, definitely. Um, although that you you're putting you know fruit in there, and I enjoy you know smoothies from other you know reputable smoothie Jamba companies. Jamba juice or things like that. Exactly. Yeah, totally. And, that we would spend money on. Right. You know. And anyways. Then, and I would get like the same like you know strawberry banana, or apple banana, or you know right. whatever the best mixture was. Um, but yeah, I would, I didn't grow to like it, you know, in, until I tried it. Right, know? right, right. And so that was something that became beneficial in my life because when I started, um, doing these health wellness with the company I work for, mm -hmm. that's they, right. they used to, you know, measure, you know, not only just my BMI, um, they look at my weight, they would look at my blood, mm -hmm. um, yeah. reports mm -hmm. or lab work rather. Yeah. And they would, um, rate us based upon uh, what our health and wellness was. Right, and your and, score. Right, and so, you know, we were graded on one through a five, mm -hmm. five being perfect, and I was five. Right. Up until 2015. That's right. Because in, from 2014, you know, I was 145 you know, five pounds, um, and then in... 2016? 15. 15, I yeah. I was like 162, so... Yeah, a lot of cruising. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, eat cruise and eat more, and that's what I live by. Right. Uh, but I learned, yeah. I learned. I learned. I um, learned the hard way because I I gained in that time. I went from that one forty five to that one sixty two. Yeah, sure. Um, I gained seventeen pounds, almost mm -hmm. twenty pounds within a year. Within that year. Yeah. And I didn't know how. Right. Um, I didn't. I I, I looked the same. But, um, that's right. And and that's what we're trying to convey too is that wellness isn't about just being skinny. It's about finding what works for you and with your body and so that you're not at risk for certain things. Um, if you do have a higher BMI body, uh, which is a higher body fat percentage right. to lean muscle, right. um, that means you're more at risk for obesity, obviously, but also diabetes, heart disease, hypertension, cancer. Um, it's really hard on your organs to maintain that amount of fat. Yeah. Um, they have to work extra hard and in doing so it's very uh, stressing on your body. So it's no doubt that you will have negative repercussions from that. So with the smoothies, um, John was actually able to, how much weight did you lose? I lost about, I'm, I'm down to like 142 now. 142. And um, you still eat pizza? I eat pizza. Burritos? We have Chipotle my, in the fridge right wings. now. <laughs> yep. We still have it. But the thing is, I balance it with a smoothie. I know. And that just with smoothies and adding smoothies to your diet, that you can attain your goals. You can keep your metrics well. You can keep your health insurance if you have similar um program at your work or at your job mm -hmm. and John and I don't exercise nearly as much as we should but mm -hmm. we're able to maintain 
normal BMI levels mm -hmm. just within our diet. Yeah. So that's that's the trick, and that's why we do it. And it's kind of like our our cocktail at night. You know, he comes home from work at night, and then I'll just make a smoothie, and then that's something we enjoy. We don't use it as a meal replacement. Uh, we eat regular meals. It's just something that we add to our diet so that we can benefit from it. And it's it. simple, affordable, and it tastes good. That's it. So for our smoothie, we like to use the Nutribullet. You can use any blender that you have on hand. Um, I just prefer this one because it cuts down the, the... We used to have a problem with kale, and this seems to be pretty effective for cutting down greens. And it doesn't make it choppy. So you just add it onto the base. And sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. All right, so now we're going to serve the smoothie. We have some beautiful glasses provided for my sister. Treat yourself. Treat yourself, smoothie. Here's one. Here's two. Treat yourself 2017. Woo! Here we go. <laughs> Top it off. All right, wonderful. And I got a little smoothie there. Cheers. Rock and roll. I'm sorry, I got a little bit more. <laughs> Cheers. Mmm. Delicioso. And just like that, that really you have a smoothie.